I've had this Jackery 500 portable power station for a few months now and they call it a solar power station because one of the options is you can recharge it with a solar panel. Now Jackery makes a compatible solar panel which is a 100 watt panel cost about $300 but I've got this perfectly good Renogy 100 watt suitcase solar panel and I want to see if this solar panel will actually charge the Jackery power station. The specifications state that the DC input, which would be the charger input, is 26.5 volts, but it supports 12 to 30 volts input. We already know that this supports the car charger, which is nominally 12 to 14 volts, depending on if the engine's running and the alternator's outputting or not. And we know that the Renogy solar panel is around 18 volts DC. That's before it goes into the charge controller. So it's within the voltage input specifications of the Jackery. And we're using a third party connector cord with MC4 on one end and 8mm power jack on the other end. And I'll provide a link in the description uh, where I bought this as well as my webpage. So what I propose to do is to connect the solar panel directly to the Jackery power station and bypass the charge controller on the solar panel. We have disconnected the charge controller from the solar panel and the solar panel is now connected to the 8mm jack that will plug directly into the jackery. And then I just simply connect the 8mm jack into the input. We get already a blue LED and we see 66 watts of charge power. And I should point out, when I set the solar panel up, I just pointed it in the sun. I didn't measure either the elevation or the azimuth. We probably could get more than 66 watts out of the solar panel if I would have set it up right. But this is just a quick test. Either it's going to work or it's not going to work. So my conclusion is, indeed, we can charge our Jackery power station with a third-party cable connected to our 100-watt Renogy solar panel. I always knew this would work, but, you know, you need to test it to be sure sometimes. While there are several advantages to purchasing the Jackery 100 watt solar panel, the main disadvantage is I already own the Renogy panel, so why should I have to buy another panel?